Here in part 4 of this video series on working with classic tweens in Flash, we'll take a look at another example that shows you how you can edit a classic tween. Let's go back to our first example where the circle moves from left to right. If you want to add another keyframe in between two existing keyframes that already have a classic tween in between them, you actually don't need to manually add the new keyframe anymore. You simply need to drag the playhead to the point where you want the new keyframe to be, and then go to the stage and make changes to the object. In this case, I just want to move it here. And once I've made the changes to the object, you'll see that Flash has automatically added the new keyframe for this new position. So now, the circle starts here, and then moves up here, and then ends up on the right side of the stage. Let's test the movie. If you want to remove a keyframe, just right-click on it and choose Clear Keyframe. Flash will then automatically adjust the animation based on the remaining keyframes. So now, this animation goes back to how it was originally. 